Hi guys, my name is Christine and I will be with you for today's session um, live from England, from Gloucester, and it's exciting to be here. Um, first of all, I'd like to uh, wish you all as well um, a happy, uh, yesterday was happy Children's Day and I forgot to mention that. Um, and uh, also, we'll be celebrating over here in England, we'll be celebrating the Jubilee over this coming weekend. Um, so that, that's just a little update here from me. Uh, so what I'd like to tell you all is to um, focus on now today's question, which is, have you ever wished to travel to space, um, to travel in space? And I'd like you to give me, well, if your wish is, if you have a wish such as this one, and uh, why and what are the reasons and what would you like to do and how are you going to get there? Um, so I'd love to hear from, from you all. So let's start with Arish first. Arish, I'd like you to first introduce yourself and tell me a bit about My you. name is Arush Kumar. I study in class 5F. My school name is Delhi Public School, University Kolkata. And my favorite of other plays in your Thank you very much. Okay, so Arish, what did you do today? Today, first I woke up in the morning at 8 o'clock, then I got ready. Mm -hmm. After that, I went to park, then I came back, then I was, then I was playing for some time. Mm -hmm. And then again, I went to park till 5 to 5.30. Then I came back, then I joined 6 to 7.30 online classes. Mm -hmm. And I joined the class now, thank you. Okay, thank you very much. And uh, so, Arish, can you tell me, have you ever wished to travel in space? Yes, I want to go to Why? space. Why? It is my <laughs> dream to travel in space. I want to see how to live in space. You want to see if I you want to manage to live in space? Yes, okay. I want to go to space because, because in space, the Neptune and the I want to see Uranus and Neptune and Mars also because Mars is not far far from Earth. And Mars is in red color. And the coolest thing of Mars is that it is not hot. Okay. Very Venus good. And what? Like uh, Venus, we can't go on Venus. If we go on Venus, we will just be fired. <laughs> okay. So you would like to visit Neptune. You would like to visit Mars. And what are the reasons why you would like to visit these places? What else do you want to see? What yes, do you want to get out of this? As a kid, I would like to visit the sun because nobody has been there and it is amazing. The view is very beautiful. I want to travel Mars because it is not too far from Earth and we can't go near to sun. So I will just, I will be a bit far. I will just land on uh, right now we are in Earth. So I will just go on Mars and I will see the view of sun from there. Okay, very good. And what are you going to do to get there? <laughs> How are you going to get there? Uh, yes, because I like I like Mars and Mars. Uh, Mars is not too hot than uh, this Earth. Yes, because yes, but Earth how? Is a third planet. But how are you? How? how are you going to get there in the first place? That's what I mean. Yes. So first, I, I need to be an astronaut for that. Mm -hmm. Then I will go by a rocket with some. Uh, with some guy with some people mm -hmm. and uh, from there my rocket will land on mars mm -hmm. okay so you're going to need to be an astronaut first so how are you going to get to that first so if you need to be an astronaut what are you going and to study how are you going an astronaut dress it is very different also and you need to wear a glass type of something whenever you wear a astronaut suit mm -hmm. I want to feel that I have seen lots of people whenever they go to space before, first they prepare like they put a glass type of thing on their head, uh -huh. helmet type of, it is in glass, uh -huh. made of glass. And then on that time they, they sit on their places, uh -huh. they buckle the seatbelt and then they go to space. Okay. We should never go, we should never go near Mercury because Mercury is a dead And planet. what are you going to do? How are you going to become an astronaut? What are you going to do? We need to we need to study science for that and physics. 
Okay, so you're going to study science. And I need first? to research on that also for one day. But my mother will not allow me. I, I will just my mother will just scold me. And what are you doing for so much for so many hours? What are you doing? <laughs> I I will try to research. Okay. Uh, and first, I need to be scientist, and I need to find out about Mars and if 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 it is safe Mars or not. If if uh, Neptune and Uranus is safe or not? First, I need to check out those. After that, I, after that, I will, I will try to be an astronaut. I need to read science, physics for that. But right now, I'm in class five, so uh, those uh, I can't study right. Very so those good. Are my age. Okay. But Thank I. For... But but uh. Sometimes when I use phone, I watch YouTube videos or I just uh, see what what I draw planets. And I like I like solar. I like studying about solar system. It is my favorite thing in science. Okay, very good, excellent, very good. And uh, so let's move on to Samikya now. Samikya. Thank you, Arush. Hi, ma'am. Hi, Samikya. Can you please introduce yourself and tell us a bit about your day? Uh, yes, ma'am. Good evening, everyone. My name is Samikya Samvardhana. I'm living in India at Orita Barampur. I'm studying in class 18 San Vincent Convent School, and my hobbies are to drink paintings and swine. Thank you. For about today's day, today I woke up at 8, uh, 8 o'clock, then I then I get ready, then I play with my brother. Mm -hmm. And after that, I after that I have to do, you know, do my homework. So I completed my homework. After completing that, I just watched head photo for some time. Then then after that, uh after that again I just go for my studies. And after that again, I just ate my lunch and then I had my tuitions. After after that, I just after my tuition, I just do, uh, I just paint a picture. It's a different, just different style. Uh, uh, after that, I was just talking with my friend, then I joined your class. Very good. Excellent. Okay, good, Samikya. Um, so, do you wish to go in space? Do you wish to travel in space? Yes, ma'am. As I already said that yeah, I want to be a scientist to, uh, regarding space, so yes, I I like to go to space because as I want to research what is there in the space, what's going on. Okay, okay. What why what do you want to research exactly? I want to research. Uh, I just want to research that. Uh, is there any life except in our galaxy? Is there any other galaxy? And is there any life? Life to be possible if there then we can go there and if there is also someone living in that uh in that planet so we can also know so i want Very to research good. that and how are you going to get there what are you going to do to get there presently i am just focusing on those subjects more and more um with more concentration with more concentration because uh the the science is the main subject for that and also maths uh so we i need to focus on both these subjects so i'm just trying to uh get more and more information about that like uh like uh in space what's going on like what are the things that have been invented and, and those things Okay, very good. Excellent. Excellent. Thank you very much, Samikya. Welcome, ma'am. Okay, next we have Shamili. Hi, Shamili. Hello, ma'am. Hi, Shamili. So, Shamili, can you please introduce yourself and tell us a bit okay. about your so day? My name is Shamili Khatwani, and I'm from Jagra, Kishore, India. And I'm a 19 year old, and I'm a And my hobbies are studying. Uh, playing video games, singing, dancing, and interacting with people. And for today's day, it was quite a good day because I woke up late. Then I had my I had my study timetable today because my exams were coming. Uh, so I had to study a lot uh, for now. Then I had I had I went for a walk with my brother. 
and then I had to go to market with my mother too, and then I just came back and just had my uh, uh, food and then just went to class. Okay, very good. And Shamini, have you ever wished to travel in space? Yes, that a lot of times when I was a child, I just, every time I saw such movies or something scientific or very uh, kind of space, then I just thought of like whenever I, uh, when I, when I get a chance to go onto a space, but when I grow up, I, when I, uh, when I saw that it needs a lot of study of scientific things, then you will need to go to school. I just cancel all the plans because I hate science. I just, I just can't think about over this. But I have, have a dream to go space and research over there and see how people just fly over their hair and then I see the Earth, the most beautiful planet. Uh, while standing on the moon. So I just wanted to go over there. Okay, very good, excellent. And how do you think you can get there? What can you do now in in this present day to get there? Can you do something that will take you there? Yes, I can only do something that uh, I can just book a, like there's a lot of uh, nowadays programs to book a seat over a rec, uh, rocket or something. I just can book a, a book a rocket for me and just go and fly in the space. Excellent, very good, good. And uh, yes, excellent, guys. So that is that is all of you with regards to your wish to uh, in, into space and the reasons why. Now, I would like you to think of, first of all, someone who inspires you, someone who you are inspired by uh, in with, within the subject of space. OK, so I'd like you to think of someone who inspires you about space and what they did and uh, what what exactly was it that inspired you and motivated you um, about space. So let's start off. Samikia immediately raised her hand here. So Samikia, can you tell me who inspired you with regards to space? Thank you, ma'am. Uh, if you would ask this question, then it's not someone who inspired me. It's just a book who inspired me. In a science book, uh, there was this, there was before starting a subject, uh, before starting a lesson, there was a short story about Kalpana Chawla, who just you know, there was just about how she became a uh, how she became an astronaut and how she go to space. So after that, I just got inspired and I just started to uh, do research something about space. What what is there exactly? Why are they going there? So after that, I just tried to got more and more indulged to that, and then only I just uh, had a I just then. I just had a goal or aim to be a scientist on school. Okay, can you tell us a bit about the story that you read? Uh, yes, ma'am. Uh, the story was like that, just Kalpana Chawla, the Indian uh, Indian girl, uh, was just one day was sitting outside in a, in a balcony and she, she, and she just uh, uh, saw the rocket uh, which was going very fast in the, in, in the cloud, in between the clouds and all, not between the clouds in the sky, she just uh, saw that. And after that, she just she searched about why they are going. Then she she tried she she tried to be more and more healthier, and she do done very much other she done much exercises. To space, she said, after seeing that, she she just had. A, the thought that I will go to space and I want to be and I will be. Since she just do many, many exercises because she had to be more fit to go. And then she finally, she go to the space center and she uh, finally got entry for that and she become an astronaut like that. Okay, very good. Thank you very much, Samikia. Welcome, ma'am. Very good. And can I have Arush, please? Arush? So can you tell me who or what inspired you about space? Mm, my mother inspired me. How did she inspire you? What did she mm, say? Like she said, if you will be an astronaut, 
So you can you can visit space anytime you want. Okay. You are not an astronaut. Mm -hmm. So you can't visit space also. If you if you, if you are astro if you will be an astronaut, you can go to space anytime. I see. Okay. And do you think your mum maybe wanted to be an astronaut too when she was no. younger? I don't know what she wanted to be. But my I know my, my father he wanted to make a startup. Maybe start up and start up. Learning while traveling. Okay, very good. So so um Arush, tell us a bit what you wrote here. Yes, the <clears throat> detail. It is about Kalpana Chawala, like she was like mm -hmm. Samkhya was telling about them. Kalpana wait. <laughs> Kalpana Chawala was an Indian born American of Indian origin to go to space. She first flew on space shuttle Columbia in nine. In 91, as a mission specialist and primary robotic arm operator. Thank you. Okay, very good, excellent. So, um, so Arush was is inspired by his mum simply because our um she she wants you to have this dream and she wants you to achieve it. Uh, so she inspires you and motivates you to do to to learn and to explore um explore space. Space, if possible, in the future. Um, and we have Samika, whose who, whose inspiration was the story uh, by Kalpana Chawla. And uh, now we have Sharmini. Sharmini, what or who inspired you um, to travel? To wish to travel in space? Hi, ma'am. I was inspired by like when I was in class four. I just studied about the Aryabhat and the first Kalpana Chawla. So I was so uh, assumed about those things that why they went to space. So for like what they had discovered related so so much well. But uh, when I grow up, like you think I watch a movie like a Mission Mangal, then I get to know about a lot of between space, like how they just. Uh, uh, how they reach to their Mars mission and then they uh, so much of discovery, so much of uh, like so much of uh, uh, this is called Jugarding. Whenever you want, whatever you want to achieve, you can achieve by simply just using your brain because it's all lie within us. The, this basically this movie just inspired me a lot. Mission uh, Mars. Uh, I basically think that their characters and their uh, using their uh, uh, using the characteristics or something very much special of whom they are having. Like these are so much of just empathized to me so much well. I just feel like if I would be a small child, I would still study the like I would take the science and just go and explore the whole space right now. So this particular movie just excellent. Thank you very much, Shamli. And Next, we have Sonny. Hi, Sonny. Hello, ma'am. Good evening. Good evening. So, Sonny, can you please introduce yourself and tell us a bit about your day? Hello, everyone. My name is Sonny Haswani. I'm from Satnati. I'm going to be graduated. I'm 22 years old. And I'm taking to class in Satnati. And if I talk about my today's day, so it was uh, as usual on my day for me. Nothing any special. Thank you. Okay. Okay. Um, so can you tell us um, a bit about um, whether you've ever wished to go to to travel in space? Yes, ma'am. Uh, I'm not wishing to travel in space, but uh, after like uh, not any type of dream to wish in space, travel to space. But yes, I think that human has been wanting to travel in space because it is in the human being nature to explore what's surrounding us and like i think that uh, fundamental reason we have been uh, in a space and to the moon in the same reason why people have climbed the average cross antarctica and attempt extreme because it is a curiosity of the person that they explore more and more like most people dream to like climb to average 
even like most of the dream to go in the space they want to saw the like uh, na- uh, nature they want to saw what is happening why earth is exist how they exist it is very important to know so and like in an india uh, our respectively mojiti started a one uh, i think it's being of uh, before uh, one or two years the chandrayaan 2 chandrayaan 2 here uh, a two robot go and take a pick uh, take a pick of the moon they want to click a pick of the moon so it is a really a nice every person want to become like they also thinking that i want to go uh, to space so many dreams are arising of this mission and like it is very important like uh, of course as all say i am also uh, very inspiring for kalpana sagra Uh, because she is really a uh, good, but uh, some incidents has happened, so, so she died. But uh, really, she inspired us, and it's a proud that she is of an Indian. Okay, very good. So she, she really, you're not particularly wanting to go to travel into into space yourself, but you found it this quite inspiring. Yes. yes. Excellent. Okay, very good, very good. Okay, so that. my question and my extended question now just a little a, a, a little question at for 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 the end here of the class um if you think about space what is the one thing in space if there was if you had the chance to go to space what is the one thing in space that amuses you and that you would like to explore the one thing that you kind of are obsessed with okay um, can you repeat okay so there is if there if you have the chance to go to space but you only ha- you're only there for a limited time what is the one thing that you would like to explore what is the one thing that you are in some way obsessed with okay you're always researching about all um reading about or watching on youtube videos etc uh so yes samikya will start off with you what is the that one thing yes ma'am i want to uh, go and research about in the back of the moon uh, we can just see the half side of the first uh, first side of the moon so i want to just research about what is there in the back of the moon the back side what is that because we are unable to see that because it's not turning uh, up to the side of the earth so i want to go there and see what is excellent that. very good okay so the dark side of the moon good uh sonny what about you i know you're not very much into traveling into space yourself but if you had to is there something that you would like to definitely uh explore and why Yes, ma'am. Like uh, most of the people said, they buy a land on moon. So I want to know how they buy it and like uh, what is the way then they buy a land. But uh, like we know in uh, in our side, how can we buy a land and making a plot? But uh, mostly we hear the news people are going and buying a moon to uh, purchasing and like uh, we hear that news and there is a water also in a moon. So yes, I want to know more about this. Okay, excellent. Thank you very much, Sonny. And Arush, <laughs> you're welcome. And Arush, what about you? What is the one thing if you had the opportunity to go into space? What is the one thing that you would like to investigate, and why? Arush. Arush, are you there? Okay, guess not. Um, let's move on to Sharmali. What about you, Sharmali? Um, I want to go and explore the moon because when I was small, so I thought there was a, there was a spot in the moon. So I thought there was a like I am standing in my room for top on the building, and I just so it's similar to like there's a tree inside the uh, moon. So I thought it was there, but my father told me, or when I get older, then I just feel like that 
there are the spots that look like a tree that uh, okay and then there's one thing that i read about my school that if you go to a moon if, uh, and you look at the china wall of china it will be clearly made you can look towards it very in with the neck with your naked eye you don't have need that telescope or something so i just want to go over there and look at the wall of china and just explore the moon the whole moon because it it seems like a very beautiful thing uh, from the earth and i will just to my heart and wave hi <laughs> So I just want to go with it. Excellent. Very good. Thank you, Shamali. Arush, are you back? Arush. Yes, ma'am. There we are. Okay, so Arush, I asked everyone what they would like to, if they had the time, you know, just a bit of time to investigate something in space, what is the one thing they would love to investigate? For mom. Moon. I want to go on Moon and Mars, and Uranus, Neptune also. Mm -hmm. First, I'll go to Moon. But then Moon, I will put there our India flag. Okay. I so I don't think so it. I I think it is removed from there because I so I saw on Google. Okay. Very good. Okay. So you would like to go to you would like to go to the Moon just to put the flag up. And why? What? What else? Why would you like to put the flag up, ma'am? Why would you like to put the flag? So I think so it is removed from the. Movie. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. Okay, okay, and very good. Uh, anything else that you want to investigate on the moon? No. Okay. Good guys. So. Um, We've got a, a bit of time now for you to discuss anything maybe that your friends have said here that you found interesting. Uh, Samikia? I yes, think she's got her hand. Yes, ma'am. Yes, do you have anything to comment on what anyone has said in class today? No, ma'am. Okay, sorry, your hand was up. Uh, Sonny, Arush, um, Sim and... Uh, Shami Lee, any, uh, any comments about what either of you said? Anything you agree with, disagree with? No, okay, very good. Now, a quick question. If you do go into space, how long would you like to stay there for? How long would you like to travel for? Samikia, let's start with you. Yes, ma'am. If you go into space, how long would you like to travel for? Okay, ma'am. Uh, for at least uh, two months. Two, two months. Two months. Okay, very good. What about you, Arush? How long would you like to travel for? Yes, ma'am. Arush. How long would you like to travel for in space? For one week. A week? week? Okay. And uh, next we have Shamali. What about you? Yeah. What do you think? How long would you like to travel for? Like whenever we, I saw a movie about that. Like if you, if you get to an, into a space, it was like if you will move your way, half of the way when you're safe. And the, over there, it will uh, the time will pass so fast that you will can't realize. So I would be like uh, maybe six months in the space. Okay, and last but not least, Sonny, if you were to go, yes, I'm like I was to go. So uh, it's depending upon the situation. Like it when I go and I feel interesting, so of course I can stay for a long time. And like when I go and I feel like uh, where I am and I want to go back. So like according to the situation. Okay, very good. Okay, guys. Thank you. Thank you very much for joining me today. I hope you have a lovely evening. Um, I've really enjoyed the session. It was really fun. And uh, I look forward to seeing you again. I will be seeing you again after the Jubilee celebrations here in England. Um, so I'll, I'll be off for a few days because of the Jubilee. And then I will see you back again. Looking forward.
forward to seeing you guys. Thank you very Thank you. much. Bye, bye, bye. Thank you. Bye, guys.